Jericho's in trouble. Did you hear that smack? That was an impressive suplex to his face. Playing my game in 18 languages in over 110 countries. Yeah. Controlling the head. He's in big trouble. Oh, and I think I saw a smile from behind. Oh, I don't know if the ladder's going to be up to task after that. No disqualification match. Again, these men can do anything they want to each other. Sheamus appears to be admiring his work. Now I got a feeling, Michael, that somebody's going to get hurt and get hurt badly in this one. Wow. Is that Sheamus is be playing with his table, guys? I don't want to know. He's doing some dangerous redecorating. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. And he's picked up that steel bell. He's enjoying this. John Morrison loves to work at an accelerated pace. Orton setting his sights and lining him up. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. This is uncalled for. There's no need to try and intimidate the fans. is due. He's good, but he knows it. The weekly episodic television show in history. This is Monday Night Raw. And no matter where you are in the WWE Universe, you have to like this. out this month and you'll find some interesting articles in there about all the superstars here in the WWE. It's Ted DiBiase. He's got hold of that ladder. Beat it. Oh my gosh! He just nailed his opponent with that crutch! He can't wait to put a hurting on his opponent here. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick! And I think it's obvious that he'll stop at nothing to win here tonight.
Difference Maker. What does Morrison have to do at this point, King? Trying to get under his opponent's skin with this one. The stars are in attendance as Monday Night Raw comes to you live from Los Angeles. We are oh, good Lord, Kane caught him. Vintage Kane. I think the... Here is your winner, Kane. And he better be. Right now, he's staring down the most sinister soul in WWE history, the legendary Undertaker. Oh, my, hung out on the ropes. You can see the pain in his eyes. And there's the release. What's going to happen now? This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages in over 110 countries. He's in big trouble here, pinned in the corner and eating haymakers. Look at this, he's pummeling his opponent in the turnbuckle with those close fish. It's hard to argue with success. And Randy Orton is a success. He has the win loss. The ref begins to count, but he continues to apply the pressure. And the throat is getting pressed on that bottom rope again. I can't believe the physicality. Oh, and he gets cracked again with that steel chair. Oh no, he's, he's gonna try and end his career. Stop the match, stop the match. That leg's gotta be broken. Little wasted movement by McIntyre. It's a straight ahead, hounding offensive style. Oh my gosh, what, what's he, he's placing his head to chair. Oh man, crushed like a melon. Drew McIntyre, so full of confidence. Here we go, this match will not be pretty. It will be grit and power and determination that will determine who comes away with the win. It's been an incredible night already here. But King, we still have that colossal main event to come. Well, after a whole lot of fighting and positioning in the rankings, tonight we're going to find out who the number one contender will be. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. You know, Randy Orton could very well be the most despised person in WWE history. It's been a wild year, but it's great to be back on Raw. No, wild doesn't even scratch. And he lights up his chest with a chop. Randy Orton has said, you don't have to like him. All in, jackpot! And there are those patterns himself after the feared and barbaric Celtic Sheamus. <laughs> and there's the aneurysm. Sheamus seems to be gloating now. How much courage? How much part does it take to perform a move like that? What's he playing in here? Oh my, enough 
of the steps. All those heavy steel steps now being used to trap his opponent. Like a dart, he crashes right into those steps. Listen, at any moment, that size advantage is going to come into play, and then this one's all but over. Oh, and he gets cracked again with that steel chair. The attack this is the 14th edition of the Hell in a Cell Premium Live Event. And here comes Old Faithful, the steel chair. like his mentor, Randy Orton. Cody Pody. That'll cause some damage. Cody should have it. Trying to get under his opponent's skin with this. Kofi is so unpredictable. Yeah. Or if some of these moves just happen out of instinct. I'll go with the instinct. It's certainly not passion and will. Oh! King, what a main event we have here tonight. Well, after a whole lot of fighting and positioning... Some of the most athletic superstars in all to the sky. I think he sits up at night coming up with things to do with him. Oh my gosh, that'll scramble your brains. And well, Coach Jake Lawler. earlier today to ensure that no matter where the action goes, we can cover it. The Dubliner. Sheamus is the first Irish-born champion in WWE history. The steel makes its introduction. Skull and exposed steel collide once more. And there's the release. What's going to happen? I don't think that chair is going to be good for much after this match. Looks like he's about to administer some big punishment. Right on the leg. He's quickly becoming attached to that chair. Delivered. Ceaseless punishment from the Viper. Orton is doing a great job remaining engaged with the opposition.